on Sunday, you know, for me, it's one of the clubs. I'm going to start with the ascension of the Lord. Dear friends, and Jesus, and his Father, and his friends, and St. Patrick. In our liturgy today, we celebrate the feast of the ascension of Jesus. This feast is placed for four days at the resurrection. As Jesus finally is taking his disciples after the resurrection and his ascension into heaven, he was seen at the right hand of the God of the Father. He was on this mystery here. Three days after he's been murdered, he was in the heart of the giver given to us in Jesus. As we come to so we appreciate our call to discipleship. We affirm our allegiance to Jesus as our personal Lord and Savior. In this way, we are ready to assume the gift that our son, Jesus, Father, won for us. Thus, in ten days, we celebrate the The first day of the church, the son, is now forming of the Holy Spirit, the first day of the people of God. The community of Jesus, the followers, 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 of confirmation, which is established by the hires, here with, and it's used to the kingdom of God. That's the fourth what we each affirm at every Mass we serve at the end of the Eucharist prayer. Through Him, and with Him, in Him, O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. I can say at every Catholic Mass, especially the ones that I attend on um, 11 and 6 p.m. at St. Patrick's. The prayer, which is called the Great Amen, is our personal affirmation of our sonship, daughter of Jesus, and our personal acceptance of what we have to celebrate, celebrated in the darkness and the most wonderful light, i.e. part of the community of believers. When any of us go to the store to make a purchase, we accept and receive the purchase, for example. That's why that is right. In the same way that an ascension of proof that we are God's children and co heirs with Jesus to the kingdom of God. That's a big thing. When Jesus rose from the dead and ascended to the Father, he was placed at the right hand of the Father. This is our receipt to heaven. This means that Jesus sacrificed that destroyed death. The penalty of our sin to restore humanity to love, to a loving relationship with God. A relationship that was lost by our first parents and their sin and carried over in each of us through human birth and on his arms. Because Jesus rose, we too will rise. On the last day and take our place with him at the right hand of the Father. We can do this because we have been redeemed and been reborn. We have died in sin and accept the promise to sin free as Jesus did. After all, Jesus did die for us. In this way, we chose to remain children of God and learners of our human inheritance. I have spent time writing this poem day to explain this great mystery of mysteries. Because I believe many of our normal Catholics do not understand or even know what we do to celebrate. No one can put faith in they do not know. No one can celebrate the joy of peace that little impacts them. Personally, we know we can lift our minds and our hearts to God and give Him thanks and commit ourselves more fully to the gift He has given us in His Son, our brother and Savior, Jesus the Christ. May the Lord bless you and keep you always close to Himself. Right. Continuing on today's mass that I attended, Father Sam writes, in biblical text, a time period lasting 40 days, months, or years, is always a period of testing, trial, probation, or discipline, ending in restoration of our Bible or renewal. There are at least 10 instances in the Old Testament, the New Testament, in which the number of 40 occurs. For example, Noah sailed in his ark after rain for 40 days and nights, as the Bible reports. The Bible in the Old Testament right? He wrote, you read about it, you see in the first chapter, where it talks about Moses, one of them, that Noah 
Picasso and his art every week for 40 days and nights. And then he's on the mountain 40 days and nights. And it's really, it's really like a wonderful 40 years in the desert after the exodus from Egypt. He was passed in the wilderness for 40 days and I've seen on there 40 days and the resurrection ascension into heaven. And then the ascension marks the completion of Jesus' birth and the history along with the resurrection. The ascension underlying Jesus. They claim he's truly God and truly human. The Messiah, the one who is saved, the truly Christian fathers show the importance of the ascension as the love overthrow Satan's power. Jesus is depicted as the one conquering the dragon, Satan, evil, and death. And nowadays, Christians are being challenged by newly fashionable atheist writers who assume that all believers are living fundamentally. They think that him is just up there and above the clouds. The truth for Ozzy does not know all very steps, but what it means to have a savior who has gone to prepare a place for us and we will return at the end of the day. Whenever we participate in the Eucharist, we are able to repeat the mystery of our faith. Christ has died, Christ is risen, Christ will come again. His mass is taught. Jesus is taken from our place tonight because he has returned to the body of the Egyptian And as she has said, the country will help the Lord, the Holy Spirit, our strength for the journey of the Father's death. Holy. This is this mass. Check this out. Now, isn't that a pretty poetry? Getting on today's military. Event at McDillard Force Base, May 9th. Here provides a hands on learning experience for military children to help them understand what parents undergo to raise their children. Now, those are some squared away kids. The first mission to Quatar welcomes them. As you can see, what better way to help kids understand why mommy and daddy have to go to war sometimes to make peace? Bring peace to the world. After all, freedom is not free, it comes with a price. Colonel Lady Ricketts was talking about a monk at a motorcycle incident that happened on days not a week and ago. Um, he stresses that, uh, you know, I, can't I can't tell you how important this is on MMS military installation. If you're coming on base with a motorcycle, you must have one of the following. One, you must have a helmet. Two, must have a reflector belt somewhere on your unit. Especially in my security station. If you came on base without a helmet or a reflector belt, they wouldn't even allow you on base. In fact, if you don't even have a motorcycle license, they wouldn't even allow you in the front gate. Much less a military ID. You better square yourself away. Safety first at all times. You all have to learn defensive driving on the military installation for a reason. As you can see, what he just talked about, someone just got killed in a close range motorcycle race. As you can see, that's a square red crown right there. He states, Team McDill is in a very busy way. McDill, unfortunately, the past few weeks have been exceptionally difficult following the tragic death of one of our senior non commissioned officers who was killed on a closed track while participating in motorcycle skills rider, rider training. We mourn the loss of a very experienced airman who contributes to our nation and cannot be replaced. If you choose to become involved in a high risk activity, remember that you are required to obtain the consent of your commander. On um, any military installation, goes without saying, as line of duty determination depending on the rigidity of your participation. Hence, 
driving course is a must for that reason. Now, everybody says that there's a little grumble, Greg, because, you know, gotta take time out to do a little safety driving course. Well, versus you staying alive versus you not staying alive. Which is really how I'd rather stay alive on a motorcycle with a helmet. Like about especially driving at night in God darn rain. What happens if a downpour happens? You know, who's gonna see you without a reflector belt? God forbid some senior 59 years old can't see you at night and hits you in the dad. You gotta remember that next time you're driving a motorcycle. I'm in a military installation around the world. I don't do it. I mean, yeah, you've been doing it and riding motorcycles for 40 years as well. Chances are, I think you'd rather have your head intact if you ever end up plastered all over the road. I'd personally rather have you know, safety for a all time. All around all comics. <laughs> Squarely, so I don't care about many of you. Here's a kid section. Jimmy Circus. Little boys and the little son says, Can I watch TV? And my mom says, May I watch TV? You mean, May I watch TV? And my little boy says, Please. May I watch TV? Please. Please. Please, mommy. The boy says, No, you need to get your homework done. Remember that I talked about it a couple of videos ago? What happened to Notice the kids, I didn't teach you this, but it works for my dad, the unit was on the office of the Air Force. I go up to him and said, Dad, Mom said no. Does that mean yes? Chances are, if we keep doing it, we'll go back and forth from one, to one parent to the other. Chances are, sooner or later, they'll say yes. And you go back to your Mom, Dad said yes. Does that mean no? But if you try, you can do it in my world. Look at the Huggins! We need to uh, uh, every other word for universal English for universal word for English and as an I. Mom. Watch the videos if you want to square yourself. As you can see. Garfield on a date. He says, Aren't the stars beautiful? Garfield asks his date. Tonight, Garfield, the day asks Garfield. They're all sparkling like little diamonds, Garfield says. You know, Garfield State, you know, I'm really glad you're here to share this evening with me. It makes me feel more special. Are you glad I'm here with you? Garfield State asks. Garfield falls asleep. How was your day? Painful. As you can see, we off the gate. While sleeping. Now, how many things do that? Oh, I'm gonna be sleeping. Dion Bailey, volunteer. Sergeant, Sergeant answers the phone. Volunteer, I guess so, but why call us? Sergeant asks, I can relate to these. Shannon, some of you can't always have That's why we have a squared away magazine, but for anybody in the other military branch, has a magazine. We thought one of the girls might be more prejudiced to the women's second period. Okay, there's an attention to our jobs. Yeah. Sorry, I have everybody in the 
The woman's plan team needs someone to keep up the school for the next one. And they say anybody but killer dealers. You see how everybody's volunteers. What's that? Woman's taking care of me.